reading all about the stars, the moons, the planets, the asteroids, and everything about this universe. <coughs> well, teaching everything could take forever and ever. But today, let me give you a quick lesson on our universe by answering a universal question. What is the universe? Zoom in! The word universe is derived from an old French word, universe, which finds its root in the Latin word universus, which translates to combined into one. And that's what the universe is. Everything combined into one mega cosmic system, including all of space, all the matter, energy, time itself, and of course, you and me. But the vital question is, what exactly is everything in this universe made of? Well, the universe is thought to be made of three types of substances. Namely, 5% normal matter, 27% dark matter, and about 68% is believed to be dark energy. Out of these, normal matter consists of the atoms that make up stars, meteorites, planets, humans, dogs, and everything else we can see. But the other vital question is, how did these substances materialize in the first place? As we learned in our The Big Bang Theory episode, a lot of scientists assume that the universe began nearly 13.7 billion years ago with a massive explosion of an extremely hot bubble that was thousands of times smaller than a pinhead. After the explosion, the universe that we know today was born. To know more, please check out our video on the same topic. The link is in the description below. Though it is difficult to know the exact spatial size of the universe, however, the observable universe, which is the ball-shaped region, is estimated to be around 93 billion light-years in diameter. But a team of scientists at the University of Oxford estimates that our universe is at least 250 times larger, or at least 7 trillion light years across. Whatever its exact size may be, one thing we surely know is that the universe's size is continuously expanding since its birth in a phenomenon known as inflation. Yes, in the 1920s, astronomer Edwin Hubble discovered the universe was not static. Rather, it was expanding as the galaxies are moving further apart from each other as the space between them grows. So the area of space we now see is billions of times bigger than it was when the universe was very young. But it is theorized that this expansion might not occur forever as the universe will eventually stop expanding and start collapsing in on itself, the so-called Big Crunch. But there is still a lot we need to know as our understanding of this subject has constantly evolved with time. However, with ever-advancing technology and knowledge and no shortage of imagination, I'm sure Someone from our intelligent audience will reveal many more secrets of the universe. Trivia time! Did you know that the Milky Way contains at least 100 billion stars and the observable universe contains at least 100 billion galaxies? Also, on March 21st, 2022, scientists confirmed that more than 5,000 planets exist beyond our solar system. But still, there's just a fraction of the likely hundreds of billions in our galaxy. Hope you learned something vital about our universe in a nutshell. And if you want to share your love, 
thoughts and reviews, kindly mail them to peekabookidsfeedback at gmail.com. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. Never mind.